Hola, mis amigos. Soy el Topo Verde. Hello there. Just want to update you on a few things. I've done a walk last year, as many of you know, um, called the Camino to Santiago. Started in France, following basically along the northern part of Spain, ended up in Santiago, which was roughly about 500 miles, but ended up doing about a thousand kilometers um, because of visits and doing a little extra bit at the end. Done it about the same time of year, um, started sort of September, mid-September this time I'm going to be starting. What I'm going to be doing this time, I'm going to be doing a thing called the Camino Mazarabe, which is basically a route through the Arab territories. That goes on to the Via de la Plata, which is the silver route. Um, I'm going to start in about a week's time, roughly the 14th of September on the Monday. But a lot of that is dependent on problems with the COVID. A lot of places are shut down and they're changing the rules as we go along here in Spain. Last time I used the hostels, the albergues mainly. Um, a lot of them are municipal ones. Most of the municipal ones are shut, some temporarily, some permanently. So this time, I'm going to be taking a tent and a sleeping setup. So I'm hoping to do a mixture of staying at the, the more reasonably priced hostels and camping out where necessary. It's roughly going to take about 55 days and it's 1400 kilometers thereabouts. Um, starts in Almeria, southern Spain, and carries on up sort of parallel almost to the Portuguese border. Then goes above the Portuguese border at the top and sort of cuts over to the left above the top of Portugal through Orense and then onto Santiago. Other places I'll be going through will be um, Granada, Cordoba, Merida, Salamanca and many other smaller towns on the way. I'll be doing reports every day if I can, depending on the connections and depending whether anything to do with any more lockdowns or the COVID or any more crisis. So, so things may change. At the moment, I'm still getting ready. I've got a week to um, get all my kit together. I've got most of it. I'm trying to go as light as possible because now I'm carrying the tent. It's going to be um, a little bit on the heavy side. I'm also hoping to set up a YouTube channel under the name of El Topper Verde and I will publish links um, on Facebook pages to make it maybe possibly easier for everybody to see. Um, that's about it for now. One other thing, if you can see down here, somebody's made me a pencil, swift and bold pencil to take notes on the way, and I've got my little El Topo Verde. Um, it'll be featuring in some of the videos probably, or maybe not, because they're a little bit on the heavy side to carry. But that was a present for me, so hope you like them. Take care, swift and bold.